Nice to meet you in person. You do. Well, it's time to go. This is it. We're here on Belle Island. We're doing a little bit of adventuring. We got Chris and we got Robin. Well, we had a couple of other riders, but uh, they pulled out. So here we are. We're going to go for a little adventure now and take you on some dangerous rides. We got lots of cliffs and lots of exploring on Belle Island. Well, that's really cool because the reason why I did this show is to get out of the city and like go on adventures throughout the province and, and find myself and discover my heritage. Cool. Find your newfie soul. Yeah, I know, yeah. exactly, yeah. Yeah. Definitely. So uh, it's really cool that uh, you're the first adventure. It's like, it's almost cool. like someone is guiding us all together to bring us on this journey or something like that. Yeah, cool. Do you believe in that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. <laughs> you don't meet by accident? No. No. Here we are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so is there any intermediate trails we can start with <laughs> first? Or yeah. Yeah. Maybe, and maybe. Then, yeah. We'll start it. We'll start it off easy. Yeah, I just want to like chill out first, and then we can oh, get yeah. into it because I, I haven't riding in a couple of years, so I'm not as good as you guys. So yeah, you will be leaving me in the dust, I would say. <laughs> <laughs> but I got a few big Marys on the go. We could have some lunch and oh yeah, okay, go bombing thanks. around and go and exploring. Yeah, well <laughs> we're we're gonna put you on the Wise Ad 125, so you're on the two stroke. So uh, okay. you got to be careful you don't crack the throttle because you'll pop the clutch. 12 o'clock wheelie. Yeah. Some call it looping her. You yeah. might loop her. Yeah, I don't want to loop her. I'm a little nervous about wiping out because I haven't been on a bike that Oh, it much. could happen. It could definitely not... happen. We're going to take you on some crazy trails, though. So okay, cool. It's a possibility that someone could wipe out. Well, enough talking now. Suit up. Let's get riding. <laughs> All right. Come, get come on now, Donnie. Get her going. All right, boss. So I, you know, kind of ran over the cameraman, but I think I got the hang of it now. Emily wasn't joking, this is really dangerous terrain, but as long as you watch your bobber, you should be fine. Well, it's one more run before our big merry lunch. I gotta say, I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, I was, I was trying to do a pop wheelie. Oh, yeah. And then I flipped back. Oh, yeah. But I hit my hand, but it's, it's, it's okay. Yeah, I just, I think I'm going to just chill it out for a little while. <laughs> <laughs> How about pass? Oh, just yeah. Pass. You need pass. 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 <laughs> <sighs> Have a little break here, boss. <laughs> All right. Sorry about that, boss. Holding you up. <laughs> The one thing I told you not to do. <laughs> yeah. No. Oh my God, my ankle's twisted. My ankle's twisted. Uh, you blew the boot off and yeah. everything. Oh, my neck's a bit rough. Maybe we'll have a break and uh, just uh, get something to eat. Oh yeah, so have a little break, a few Big Marys. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> This portion of Skidoo and can -Am's Adventures Unknown has been brought to you by Mary Browns, Husqvarna, and Hickman's Chevrolet. <laughs> that Skidoo feeling presents Unparalleled power so you can push the limits. Introducing the 2020
many ski do trail and crossover sleds. The ski do sales event is on now. Visit your local dealer for details. Hey everybody, make sure to follow our adventures on social media. All right, close your eyes. I got a surprise for you now. <laughs> uh, I heard it was your birthday. Uh, we can't keep the candle lit because it's a little bit windy here, but happy birthday. You gotta pretend blow it out now. Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you, happy birthday Thank you. to Donnie. You had a sick wife out, but you can have a big Mary too. <laughs> I kept up pretty good. You but kept up, yeah. I think you were kind of... Uh, not going full throttle, you were taking it kind of easy. Today. Well, a little bit, but you did a good job. Yeah. But you did looper. I did looper, <laughs> yeah. I was trying, I was so excited, I was trying to do a wheelie, and oh, yeah. then, um, yeah, but I'm okay, thanks yes. for asking. Yes, yeah, well, I figured you were, by the way, you're eating that Big Mary. <laughs> yeah. That tells all. <laughs> yeah. No, I'll never lose my appetite. No. Especially for Big Marys. Yeah. <laughs> they are a Newfoundland, staple oh they? definitely thank you for the birthday well wishes welcome how do you know it's my birthday i seen it on facebook Did you? yeah <laughs> facebook tells all yeah you can't hide anything can no you? that's the, how i found you the big day yeah um, you're saying your grandfather was like a photographer or something his name was ben hansen and he put out uh probably 13 books 14 books ben hansen yeah is my dad's buddy no my, way my dad he liked meeting the locals and going to going watching people south cod and a lot of them are real fishery based there's a lot of stages and a lot of cod and a lot of back way back before the moratorium it's pretty neat because it's a whole nother way of life you don't see that as so much anymore not so big he explored every single nook and cranny of the whole entire province and even now when i look at his books i think i've been a lot of places but there's places that i've never even heard of and i gotta go on google and be like where the heck is Boxy's Cove or where is this place? Like he's, he's in all these crazy places. So he took lots of cool pictures. He certainly loved, loved the province, that's for sure. And now you're using the influence of social media. Yeah. Like your grandfather did with, you know, picture books yeah. to tell your story and your adventures. But yeah. See how small Newfoundland is? Like your grandfather and my yeah. dad were best buddies. Yeah, like, and we had no idea. Let's get a selfie. Good morning. <laughs> Got it? I'll post it, dirt bike riding on Bell Island with my new friends. All right, time to get back in the saddle now. You can't let the one, one wipe out uh, hold you back. <laughs> All right, let's go. Well, I'm not gonna lie. After my wipeout, I was feeling kind of nervous, but Emily's sense of adventure was contagious. So we went off on another burn on the bikes.
thanks for bringing me out to the big adventure, the big dirt bike adventure. Thanks for coming to my rescue when I did my nasty flip. <laughs> and thanks for coming along with us too, man. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna head her back to uh, the campsite and- uh, Nurse your wounds. Yeah. <laughs> Well, that was an amazing day dirt bike riding on bell island what a great way to start my journey kink my neck a bit but uh, at least i'm in one piece oh, what's this? I guess I'll swim out in the North Atlantic to a sailboat and go on an adventure with uh, Jason. Let's go. The Chummy Jigger was moored just off the beach of Belle Island in the mystical land of rock stacks. And check out this rock. It looks like a Lion King protector sphinx of Belle Island. Danny, you made it. How you doing, man? Good. Oh, Come aboard. Oh, my God, that's cold. <laughs> Good to see you, man. I do, I do. How are you? I'm great. I'm great. Like I said, welcome, welcome aboard. Your day just got better and so did mine. Yeah, refreshing, ugly. <laughs> Woo! Good damn bell on under mine. Yeah, it's nice. I got the tent set up over there. Excellent. And we went dirt bike riding around, well, the back of the... All the sand dudes. Yeah, on the other side there, yeah. With Perfect. a girl, Emily. Perfect. She's an amazing dirt bike rider. Yeah, yeah. And we had some merry rounds up there on the point. Did ya? And then I got your message. Wicked. And where are you going to take me? I don't know, man. We're going to go for a sail, maybe catch a fish, have a feed. Yeah, damn. Uh, I got some wrecks I want to show you. Okay, cool. Yeah, some of the old uh, whaling wrecks up there in Conception Harbor. Okay, that'd be great. Yeah, it'd be super good. Now this is really cool, an unexpected treat to be on a sailboat in the middle of Conception Bay. My journey is already better than I hoped. This portion of Skidoo and can -Am's Adventures Unknown has been brought to you by Rustler's Family Restaurant, Best Western Plus St. John's, Town of Labrador City, Hickey's Timber Mart. Rustler's Family Restaurant in the Fall River Plaza. Home-cooked meals just like mom's. Rustler's next to Breakers and the local in the Fall River Plaza. And don't forget the all-day breakfast. Welcome 
to the Best Western Plus St. John's Airport Hotel and Suites. Enjoy a delicious meal at Amelia's Restaurant and Lounge. 175 beautifully appointed rooms and suites. For your vacation, business travel, or family getaway. for all your home construction and renovation projects, offering fast next day delivery and Air Miles Reward Miles too. Hickey's Timber Mart, Harbor Main, CBS, and Torbay Road. Who are Teamsters? Teamsters are part of everyday life in Newfoundland and Labrador. We make on-time deliveries that drive our economy. I'm a Teamster. It's my union. Our members proudly work for our community. I'm a Teamster. It's my union. We drive the trucks for a green future. I'm a Teamster. It's my union. We are the skilled tradespeople you depend on. I'm a Teamster, and this is my union. Teamsters, it's our union. So where are we heading to, Skipper? Uh, we're heading up to the fishing grounds now. Get that catfish we talked about. So, up Peepies. where those guys are yeah. fishing. Right. Now, Danny, you know you're on the chummy jigger. You know what a chummy jigger is? Uh, no. Nobody knows what a chummy jigger is. <laughs> What's the Tommy? <laughs> it's in the book of Newfoundland English. Okay. Yeah. As that which cannot be named. Okay. So if you got a chummy jigger, nobody really knows what you got. Yeah. Did you name this yeah. boat? I named this yeah. boat. Yeah. Boat. yeah. And every other boat that I'll ever have will always be the chummy jigger. Always be yeah. chummy jigger. Yeah. Handles really well though. Huh? Oh yeah, nothing to it. Yeah. Nothing to hit out here. Like steering a boat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dan. I'm gonna go down and get that rod ready. Now you've got the wheel. No sweat. Here we go. Help no, yourself to anything you want. There's two ducks or puffins that I think I'm going to run over. They're not moving. Peanut butter. Are they like Keep pigeons? They'll move. Oh, they're good. Oh. So I guess we're going to the cod grounds now and. Uh, <laughs> Trying our luck now, fishing. Hopefully, catch a big old cod, got her on the deck, and fry her up. That's living. It feels so amazing to be out here cod fishing. It's the bedrock of our history. For 500 years, we've been catching cod. And to think I have one on the hook is just amazing. You know, when you think about this little fish, hey, is the backbone why we exist and why we're here, hey? And the whole reason we're in Newfoundland, isn't it? Yeah. And now uh, we're lucky enough to be able to catch a little bit of fish for, for our food fishery Yeah. on the weekends. So, yeah, I just cut that up into some sizes about that big. Maybe no, but I want to talk big. more. What do you want to do? <gasps> about Newfoundland and cod. Like, what? Well, you know, this is like, this is like our god, right? This is like why we're here, why we're... That's backbone the, for our colony, isn't it? The reason we're here. Amazing. The reason we're here. Yeah, and don't take it for granted because there was a while ago that we couldn't catch fish. Remember that? Yeah. And uh, now they've loosened up a little bit on the restrictions, but... Uh, I guess you could have uh, cod nuggets too, right? I think that's where we're headed with this right now. boy. Mm. Looking good. Cool. So we're ready for the deep fire soon, hey? All right, let's get this fish rolling. I'm gonna do the first one, you can do the rest. Okay. I'm just gonna stab that in there. Roll it around for a bit. Let her... Oh, wet and dry. You got yeah, it, yeah, you I got, got it. it. This is a little trick. We're gonna lower it right gentle. This is where it gets dangerous. You're not gonna the moment safety. I've been waiting No for safety it. glasses or anything. When is it done? I don't know, did you hear it scream when you put it in? No. Well, 
I go by color because I don't want to keep track of time anymore. No. Yeah, they're almost done. Yeah, I see you're not wearing watches or anything no, like that. No, my you're buddy. Off, you're like completely... Off the grid, as much as I can be. Relic. As much as I can be. Oh, that's looking good now, Don. Let's have a look. What do you think? Oh, my God. What? Huh? Golden brown, Golden man. Golden brown, buddy. Well, isn't that a bad feed? No, man, this is great. Excellent. Just for us to doctor orders. Well, like I said, uh, this should keep you well fueled for your next adventure, wherever that is. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I have to check my Facebook. <laughs> what? Uh, it actually tastes like beer. But it's really good. There's a little little hint of uh, local beer in that. Absolutely. Got some tartar here. Thank you. Made yourself. I don't know. We're just going to call it sauce. This yeah. Is relish sauce. And, uh, yeah. Re relish and, uh, and secret sauce. So after this, you can sail me back to Belong? Yep, you finish this up now, and we'll be leaving in a half an hour, and we'll, uh, we'll sail down to Belong. Probably takes a couple hours, and uh, sit down and uh, relax a little bit on the boat. Yeah. Is there any um, coyotes or anything on Belong? No. <laughs> <laughs> Should make for a spooky <laughs> night, yeah. yeah. If you see a red flare go up, can you yeah, come so back? Yeah, I'll have a look for you, need, yeah. I might need some uh, rescue. Yeah. This portion of Skidoo and can -Am's Adventures Unknown has been brought to you by Overhead Door NLFD Limited, City of Cornerbrook, One World Filter, and Park Avenue Law. Classical. Modern. Contemporary. With. Or without windows. Sand. Claystone. Mocha. It's a girl I go Take a deep breath. Here at the mouth of the Humber River, at the end of a deep saltwater harbor, the Bay of Islands reaches into the heart of the Long Range Mountains in Corner Brook, Newfoundland, and Labrador, where stories begin. Take a deep breath. Are you heading out on that special vacation or important flight? Well, there's a lot that can happen you should be aware of. You have rights to airlines and plane manufacturers but for you didn't know about. Defend and protect your rights against air traffic incidents like extreme turbulence, head injuries, service car collisions, food poisoning, hot liquid burns, Park Avenue Law, experts in aviation personal injury claims. Transportation of the cast and crew of Adventures Unknown has been brought to you by Hickman Automotive Group. Featuring the Silverado. Adventures Unknown would like to thank the Skidoo and Can-Am dealers of Newfoundland and Labrador for their generous support. On our way back to Bell Island, it was time to stop and chill and play a little music. Rolling, rolling. I hear a train go. It's rolling around the bend. I ain't seen the sun. I don't know where. No, I'm stuck across the tree. And I keep dragging. On down to San Anso. Jason and Emily both inspired me with their shared passion of adventure. For Emily, it's dirt bike riding, and for Jason, it's sailing. But the spirit that drives them is the same. It was sad to say goodbye to Jason at the end of this magical day but I really look forward to seeing where this journey is going to take me next. Hey everyone, it's Donnie from Big Jib Productions. If you'd like to go on one of these exciting adventures around Newfoundland and Labrador, Visit us 
on adventuresunknown.ca. program is brought to you by Rogers Anyplace TV. Enjoy exclusive content for free. Visit RogersAnyplaceTV.com. Call the Rogers TV viewer response line, email us, or connect with us on social media. There are soldiers in my family. I first joined the Legion to honor their service. Now I volunteer there to be of service myself. I know my membership helps Canadian veterans get the support they need. I've personally seen it help veterans get through some pretty dark times. Many have come out stronger than ever. For a lot of them, the Legion feels like home. It's nice to be part of that. Hello, I'm Loidera Quaco. I'm here at the rooms where we just finished recording the Sharing Our Culture series that will be coming soon on Rogers TV. Hey! 